Uh, totally unacceptable. The Boston school superintendent responding to an incident at the Condon School last month. I'm furious. And Acelia Cueva says her three-year-old son with special needs was physically strapped to a chair. It was a regular chair with handmade straps to the waist taped, duct taped to the floor. Cueva says a substitute teacher reported the behavior to DCF. The minute we found out, we launched full investigation, put, you know, staff involved on leave. The child's mother warns the DCF reports indicate there are more incidents, but the superintendent calls this isolated. We don't believe this is widespread. We believe this is very isolated, but nonetheless, anytime you have a situation, we want it to be thorough. Cueva says she is also upset because she only learned of the incident two weeks later from DCF and not from Boston Public Schools. There was a failure in communication in that it was uh, it was out of order. It had to do with the vacation and DCF and DCF following up immediately. Um, but I can imagine that for a parent, that's extremely jarring to not hear from the educators and to hear from DCF. So again, I apologize to her for that. Superintendent Skipper also says that the use of restraint is rare, that teachers are trained for those instances, and that this was not an example of one of those. Again, the investigation is underway. Live in South Boston, Sarah Kanji, WCVB News Center.